The stars of SmackDown Live have something to prove tonight. They're going to leave it all in the ring because that's what SmackDown Live is all about. Byron, put on a helmet, pull up your big boy pants. It's going to be a long, long night. Let's go. Self-proclaimed most beautiful woman in all of WWE. Self-proclaimed cold, you listen to yourself. I'm sitting right here. I'm making the proclamation. We are all witnessing the most beautiful woman in all of WWE. Corey, you're a bit biased. So? At least he admits it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Staten Island, New York, Carmella. Carmella's proven herself as one of the most talented in-ring competitors, but according to Carmella and Corey, she's also the best looking. According to many people, Cole, you clearly just don't speak to the right people. Well, Byron told me she wasn't best looking. Why are you being a snitch, Michael? Would you take the advice on whiskey from someone who's never had a drink? I don't think so. Gone are the days of moonwalking. The trash talking remains. And let's be honest, I think we were all a little bit over the dance break thing. Hey, I miss those dance breaks. You're the one. And from Jersey City, New Jersey, the SmackDown Women's Champion. Jay Lee. The WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. This is going to be good. <laughs> the champ knows that a big win tonight sends a message to all of the top contenders. Exciting when the superstar is in the ring. A competitor who has no limits. She wouldn't know her limits if they were right in front of her, Michael. Some might think she's reckless at times, but it's impossible to get her to change her ways now. And I wouldn't expect her to fight any different in this matchup either. And then you have the untouchable Carmella. Some have a misinformed opinion about Mella as a superstar who just runs her mouth too much. But anyone with that view is drenched with envy, knowing that every time the bell rings, Carmella is able to back up every truth she speaks. I don't know if I would completely agree with all of that, Corey, but I will not deny that Carmella has been, on occasion, known to put her money where her mouth is once that bell rings. Carmella saw it. There's no denying that she's also about as vicious as they come. Corey, 
What do you think Carmella should rely more on here? As much as Carmella's trash talking has served her well in the past and continues to do so, ultimately she needs to focus on just being as physically vicious as we know she can be. All the momentum swinging away from Carmella. Mella needs to rethink her strategy now. Counter on Carmella. She's showing it's not a time to lie down, it's a time to fight back. Oh, that'll send a shock down your spine. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. She's lost some of that energy she had earlier. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Up and down, standing sheer noise. There's two! Kick out, she still has life. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Counters, this could be an opportunity. A counter answered by another counter. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Uh-oh, she has trouble coming. Not gonna be easy to get out of this. She almost a miraculous escape and a side slam. Brought down and just uh, twisting the oh, neck twist, ruthless. Mella just can't seem to stop this offense. Mella's being systematically worked on. Oh, this match may be nearing its limit. This is a very dangerous situation now. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. That turns it around for Carmella. She left an opening. Put down face first. Uh-oh. This thing is bad. 
match has come to an end. Wow. She did it, picking up a big time W. Wait a minute, not done yet. A couple matches over, guys. Sometimes you gotta learn to cut your losses. Oh. That didn't work out the way she envisioned it. And nonetheless, the celebration will continue.